I just ordered these um, blanks, Mr. Brog's blanks off of Amazon. Um, 10 of these came in the package. So we're just gonna do a quick, quick open here and uh, take a look and we'll see about making uh, some of these perhaps into uh, some decent pipes. So here, here we've got a bowl, but um, really don't have any, any way to put a stem on that guy. Now this guy um, looks pretty good, although I don't think we've got the draft hole all the way through, but again, that's uh, easily fixed. Uh, we got another blank here. This one definitely has the uh, draft hole through there. Uh, some good work uh, that could be done on this guy. We've got another one here with, um, it would appear that the draft hole is not drilled on this one, but again, no big deal there. Different shape we can work with. Nice little guy here. Uh, draft hole is completed. Um, that'll make a cute, cute little pipe. Another one, nice, uh, good size, good size um, pipe blank there. That'll be nice to work with. We've got another, boy, these are all looking really good. Even these ones that don't have a draft hole, um, you know, we can easily fix that. And uh, a little chip out there maybe, but... Again, hey, we can make something work with that. Again, we've got the draft hole looking good. Got another, another one here. Ooh, that's going to be a fun one to work with. And finally, uh, finally one more here. Uh, so again, some of them have the draft hole, some don't. Uh, but uh, boy, I think we've got a lot, a lot of good blanks that we'll be able to work with. <laughs> Walk the earth, diesel and dust, feed in the dirt, he showed us love, he showed us life, he showed the way, he was alive. So I'm really excited about this new pipe uh, that I just finished. This is from the Mr. Brog's Blanks that I had purchased on Amazon. And uh, this is a really, really stout looking pipe. And uh, there's there's really three things I like about this. One, I really like the, the stout size. I like something you can really grip onto. Uh, it's the first one that I did that is uh, fully rusticated. Um, so you'll see that. We'll zoom in a, a little bit there uh, on the rustication. And, I'd gotten an idea from a fellow on YouTube. He had carved the United States Marine Corps uh, logo into the front of one of his pipes. And so I thought, you know what? We're gonna do the Centurion's helmet. Uh, I do some Roman reenactment and um, many people know that I, one of my characters is uh, a, a Roman Centurion in Caesar's army. And of course it was also a Centurion at the tomb of Christ. Uh, who famously said, truly, this man was the son of God. So, a little centurion helmet there. So, uh, we're going to give the centurion a first smoke and see how he does. So far, so good. Got um, one of my favorites right now. I've uh, gone back to uh, classic Codger blend, Prince Albert. Oh, yeah. Draw seems fine. So I think we're going to have many, many pleasurable marching miles with the Centurion. 